Right, hello all you gorgeous people, tis I, not Dr. Tamara, just here, not being a doctor really, but telling you all the things that they should be. Now today I want to talk to you about CMOS. I'm going to make this very, very quick, but if you haven't heard about CMOS, you clearly had your head buried under a rock for the last few years. CMOS has exploded in the alternative health scene. It is basically a seaweed. Um, it comes from Ireland and it comes from the Caribbean, all right? Different ones have slightly different properties, some are better than others, but essentially it is a seaweed. And if you know anything about seaweeds or sea vegetables, they are a powerhouse of minerals, all right? Loads and loads of minerals. Now, the one reason I wanna talk about sea moss is because I've been using sea moss for a while. And the reason I wanna talk about it is because I found it quite exciting because there's so many people suffering with like fertility issues and like just sexual issues. And I, CMOS was crazy like to, within two days of taking CMOS I was nearly flipping humping trees I've never been so like wet naturally in my life and isn't it mad how to make the connection that again with the as above so below as within so with that sea CMOS comes from the sea and it creates wet like feelings within you it's absolutely it's just a magical thing but the reason I want to talk about it is because like I said so many people suffer with this and no one talks about it men don't want to be saying oh, I'm 35 and I've got no sexual desires all right it's not natural but you know with testosterone lacking and the constant chemical and toxic assault we are all under our fertility our our bits are kind of under threat all right and this sea moss can really help to get you to help reverse the effects of you know some of these negative effects that these toxins and the environment is having on us so if you are struggling with lure libido i can't say if you're struggling with fertility that would be there's so many issues that would come with that that would be very um, irresponsible but if you are suffering with maybe lack of sex drive and those sorts of things, get some sea moss, all right? That shit will get your libido up within a couple of days. Make sure you get a good source of it, all right? Um, I would say capsules over the gel. I don't wanna knock anybody who's making the gel, but you need to take quite a significant amount of the gel versus what you'd need to take in capsules, all right? And I'm just one of them people I like to get on with it and get the job done, so I use the capsules and they work fantastically well. Um, but yeah, anyway, you've got to get the CMOS into you, I just suggest you get some. It's also um, a fantastic, um, like I said, source of vitamins and minerals. I think it's got like 82 of the minerals. Are, we have like 102 in our body and I think there's like 80 plus in the in in the sea moss which is amazing all right now i will say um everybody says how great it is nobody mentions the fact that it can actually um it can mess with your thyroid a bit all right so if you have thyroid issues make sure you are doing your due diligence and going to see an actual doctor before you start taking any of these things but for good normal healthy people that maybe just need a little bit of a libido boost CMOS is your friend. Anyway, you gorgeous people, if you've liked this video, please let me know below in the comments and please subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you soon. Thank you for watching.